you can follow me on facebook.com hammers reviews facebook.com hammers review stream and facebook.com hammers review streams <coughs> also you can follow me on twitter dot com blueboy 85 you can also follow me on instagram Instagram.com, Hemsreviews1. My Twitch channel is twitch.tv, Blueboy1985. <coughs> if you have missed any streams live, I export all streams onto my YouTube channel, which is youtube.com, Hemsreviews. <coughs> if you would like to help, Support the channel, you can donate via my Twitch link via PayPal. Or if you don't have PayPal, you can donate via Patreon at patreon.com Hammers Reviews. And we are live. <coughs> this is a qualification match for the tag team tournament so it's going to hopefully going to be a fatal four way the Hardy boys going against Humberto, Carrillo and the Apollo Crews we have a full scale anywhere match Io Shirai going against Ruby Warrior we have another tag team match which is another qualifying match Scott Dawson and Dash Wilder the revival going up against Mustache Mountain the fourth match is a one on one match. Johnny Wrestling, Johnny Gargano with his wife, Kenneth Larray as his manager, Gargano Kent, Sami Zayn. <coughs> and the main event of the evening is a no hold bars match. Kevin Owens, Gargano Kent, Samoa Joe in a rivalry match. Kevin Owens is currently the number one contender, so that can change. <coughs> we had some fantastic matches on the free show. Humberto Carrillo is the nephew of the late great Hector Garza and cousin of Angel Garza on the Raw Brand. He was formerly Ultimo Ninja. <coughs> the next pay per view special will be in six weeks' time. from Cameron, North Carolina, Matt and Jeff, the Hardy Boys. Jeff Hardy's on Smackdown and Matt Hardy is in AEW. Teaming with the Bucks of Youth. Hailing from Mexico City, Mexico, Humberto Corrillo and his tag team partner. Wayne and 
approximately 240 pounds from Atlanta, Georgia, the Apollo Crews, the former U-Haul nation, someone that is a heavyweight that moves like a cruiserweight. Mitch Sanders is in again. This is a regular tag team match. If the Hardy Boys win this match, it'll be two points to them. Nice high angle DDT from Humberto Carrillo. Makeshift teams only get one point. Nice straight jacket release German suplex. Nice kick to the mid second, followed by the DDT. I do apologise. The council are cutting the grass. Only enough for a run cut from Humberto Corillo. <coughs> nice inverted DDT from Humberto Corillo. Nice hard on to from Humberto Carrillo, tags in brother Jeff Hardy. Nice DDT from the charismatic Enigma. Tags in Apollo Crews, Apollo Crews is very underutilized. Nice elbow from Apollo Crews. Nice short hand closer. Apollo Crews with the knee to Jeff Hardy. I'm going to see if anyone's on. Nice power bomb. Another power bomb. Release power bomb. The, mm, the matrix tag team are <coughs> working very well together. Both of them one, only enough for a one count. Nice face buster from Jeff Hardy. I remember the Hardy Boys being in Horseman Talent in the WWF, I think it was 1993, 1994. But they actually signed in, I think it was 1998. Question to everyone What year was the WWF taken over by Vince Jr.? If anyone knows, please let me know in the chat section. Nice knee strike from Apollo Crews. Nice Samoan drop from Apollo Crews. Nice high angle Saito Suplex from Apollo Crews. Apollo Crews is showboating. Jeff Hardy reverses the DDD. Nice snap mass suplex from Jeff Hardy, followed by the snapping neck breaker. Nice elbow strike from Jeff Hardy. The drop to <coughs> the lower regions. Nice DDT from Jeff Hardy. 
one. Only enough for a one count. Brother Nero has to do better than that. Nice kick to the midsection, followed by that twist of fame. Weakening the follow through his arm. I think current present fans, the, the ones that broke through that through there, are not just boys, but a nice high angle leg drop from the top right. Go flip in. One, two, only not for a two count. <coughs> I have a website. And the stats will be released. The rankings will be a nice hot take from Chef Hardy. It will be Friday. The rankings will be up. The follow-up was close to one, two, only enough for a two count. Nice drop kick. A nice high angle drop kick. Nice kick to Mahoney's arm, followed by a high angle elbow drop. Nice spin kick. The follow up is taking a battle curvilio. <coughs> who is from Mexico City. Nice snap DDT from Humberto Carrillo, goes to one, two, only enough for a two count. Robert Jeff kicks out. Sorry, breaks the pin up, sorry. I'm getting flustered. Let's head to the midsection. Is Matt setting up for... No, he's setting up for the tree of gold. And does absolutely nothing. Because he's a mule. An obsolete one. This game is very out of date already. <coughs> nice bunch from Matt, but he does not capitalise. Humberto Carrillo seems very fatigued. That's the only thing I have changed and some rivalry matches. Kevin Owens is actually feuding with John Moxley for the championship. <coughs> so that is a short feud. Another feud is Tony Storm, God of Dance, Peyton Royce. Nice face plum buster. Bomb. <coughs> Matt Hardy. Are we going for a tandem offense? We are not. No. Matt Hardy knocking the piss out of the young man from Mexico. Tagging his brother. Jeffrey Nero Hardy. Nice snap. DDT from Roberto Carrillo. Dragging. Jeff to the central of the ring, goes for the pin. One. Only enough for a one count. <coughs> nice high angle kick from Humberto Carrillo. Humberto Carrillo with the moonsault with the hand thing. Only enough for a two count. Mm. The referees take about three years to get up. Get get down, I should say. Nice Irish whip from Humberto Carrillo. Setting up a snapmare suplex. Going for the pinball spinning. No, it's not called that, it's called Spring, Springboard Moonsault. That, that was wicked. 
if I plot correctly. No, it's inverted atomic drop from Guava Nero with the twist of fate. Go for the pin. One, two, a follow boots. Wakes up, wakes up for his pin. Mbato Carrillo attacks the referee. I don't know if it was on purpose. Mbato Carrillo is getting pumped up. We will be crowning our new tag team champions at the next pay per view, which is. I haven't got a name for it yet. If anyone's interested in helping in that aspect with names, venues, superstars, so we can do a proper super, super card. Both get in before the 10 count, that was very close. Yeah, it's the council. It's, it's maintenance day, so I can't really complain. Nice taking from Apollo Cruz. Two seconds, I might have to turn up a little bit. Nice high angle slam from Apollo Cruz. How's your back today? Is it feeling any better? Nice high angle drop kick from Apollo Cruz and Mbato Cavillo. Um, Mbato Cavillo, Angel Gaza's cousin and Hector Gaza's ne other nephew. Nice point. No, no, sorry. Nice falling elbow from the follow crew. Nice dropped over from Jeff Hardy. Nice Japanese on drag from a follow crew. Mm. Is she doing okay? I haven't heard anything for, for, forever. Nice swing neck breaker from Apollo Cruz, but it's showboating to the crowd too much and acting like a complete ninny. I have got a website now, so I will let you know later on what my website is. It's just for fantasy booking and whatnot. Nice Gorilla Press Slam, followed by the Standing Moonsault. Go for the pin. One, two, three. Your winner, Apollo Cruz and Humberto Carrillo. Advance into the Tag Team Total Tournament. It will be a four-way elimination style match. Can you ask her to give me a call later on if I give you permission to? No, no, that's what, what that's what it looks like in general. So, can you ask her to give me a call? I'll give you permission to for you to give my sister my number. The next match is a false count anywhere. Oyo Shirai going up against Ruby Harayat. I know he's one of the newer ones. Who do you think is going to pick up the W? Io Shiroi or Ruby Riot? I'm going for Io Shiroi. Well, 
welcome to anyone that is new. The streams are all interactive, so if you would like to ask anything, ask away. <laughs> so, for more. What did you think of Money in the Bank pay per view? Out of 10, how would you rate? Heading from Japan, Ayo Shirai. Hmm, this cross cuttings. Because some people are pissing the mold and crying online. At least they've got they've got to make use for now. <coughs> Hayden from Lafayette, Indiana. Ruby Riot. Mm, I, I think I think that would have been silly. At least there, at least there was no accidents, no serious accidents or injuries, which was a good thing. To cash in a total of two, you need three points. If you've got more than three points, nice playing ball. Saito Super from Ruby Riot. Strengthening the pick out of Ayo Shirai. Nice high angle, belly to back suplex. Why in the hell do Shane Thorne and the Iconic still have a job? Because I don't think they're going to ever improve. So I, I think they should have been putting a chopping block forward. Nice knee to the nose of Iron Shiro. Nice. Get followed by the power bomb. Okay then, do you know the answer to this question? What year did Vince Jr. take over? Nice brilliant suplex, Ayo Shirai with a satellite head scissors. Go for the pin. One. Ha ha ha. Nice kick from Ayo Shirai. Is that, is that Steve Cutler? I've got to think who is. I know one of them is Steve Cutler, Gunner, and is it Blake? Nope. Nice Angel's Wing Star Maneuver from Oyo Shiroi. Nice, high angle half and under. One, two, reversal. Yeah, Gunner, I don't. Yeah, Gunner, I, I don't think. Yeah, I don't think he's ever going to improve. He was good in impact. Nice flat get for my own Shirai. Nice kick to the side of Ruby Wright's head by Oyo Shirai. <coughs> nice whip to the outside from Oyo Shirai. Close for the pin. One, two, 
I've got this with a full scout anyways, back. Hmm, I don't know. Hmm. <clears throat> if you look it up, it would make sense. I, I don't think he's ever going to be a star. Scarlet's the star out of the two. He's not. Oh, sorry, I thought Philip in. The referee's slow on this one. One. Only enough for a one count. She was down for at least a two, but the ref referee being a retard. I'm oh, sure it's been whipped into the turnbuckle. No, sorry. The ring steps. No, it's high angle Horakumana from Ruby Riot. Are you sure? With the nice STO. Into. What is that submission called? I've got a thing for the submission called. Doing. Going for the pin finally. One, two, only enough for two and seven eighths. Why are you trying to whip into the steps from Ruby Wright? First for pin one, two, only enough for a two count. Nice, Bulldog Headlock. My goal for Twitch is to get more than three viewers and at least 50 followers. So hopefully to get a Twitch affiliate That is one of my main goals for this year. Nice, high angle body slam. Goes for the pin. One, two, only enough for a two, because the referee was too slow once again. My goals I would like to set for future streams is viewing to get at least four or five views, maybe ten out of a push. Only enough for two and seven eggs. Nice whip. Back into the ring. Nice jump in neck breaker from Ruby Boy. Mm. How, ma how many v um, viewers do you get on average? I don't actually know what the, uh, if you go onto your Twitch dashboard, it should tell you what, um, something to do with, like, your affiliate is. I think you have to average, um, three, um, average of three views, but it's probably more. One, two, three. And your winner, Ruby Royer. Mm, 
that was a very good match. The next match is the revival going up against the Mustache Mountain. I've done everything else. I've done hours and I think it stays streaming. I've done that, but the only thing I haven't done so far is average of three views and 50 followers. Mmm, that's nice mountain. Mm. South Carolina or North Carolina? I know it's one of the Scott Dawson and Dash Wilder, the revival. This is another qualification match for the Fatal Four Way Elimination Star match. Have you got any ideas for pay per view themes or show you want to put on? Hailing from Wolverhampton, England, Trent Seven and his protege, Tyler Bates, collectively known as Mustache Mountain, they are two thirds of British Strong Style with Pete Dunne. I've got a hench beard, so shut the fuck up. Mustachio Mountain. I think Trent Seven's the oldest out of him and Ooh. Prob probably the title matches would be Trent Seven and Dash Wilder to start things off. I think the revival of all ungrateful bastards. They'll they'll be back if AEW screws them over. Nice European uppercut from Dash Wilder. Dash Wilder with the boot to the throat of Trent Seven, Tad Lynn, Scott Dawson, nice sleeper hold, the revival remind me of the Bone Busters, Tully Blanchard and Arn Anderson, nice ch chin breaker. Kenta Kabashi style slaps. But Kabashi Kenta slaps harder than that, and so does Mizawa Mitsuhara. But I'd have to change the name of it, show wise, but I don't know. It's probably it's going to be in five weeks' time. No, it's only six weeks time, but five after this is finished. Nice high angle. Suplex into the bin, only enough for a one count. Tags in. Tyler Bate, who is 23 years of age. Tolerate with the aeroplane spin. The aeroplane spins making me very disorientated. Mm. 
the energy drink in my snake is strawberry and kiwi and guava flavour. I've combined two of them. Went for my new shipment of sour apple, which is a new flavour of snake, and the Tropicilla cans. What is everyone's favourite energy drink? It can be conventional energy drinks. Nice Andre from Tyler Bay. At least I'm not calling him Tyler Black today. Okay, any other ideas for pay-per-view ideas? Feel free to let me know. Mike's well, half and half. DDT. Helen Selfie is one. I was thinking... My other thought was Elimination Chamber, maybe. Nice. Float over. Butterfly suplex. From... Toilet Bay. Stem song. Dash Wilder's hand. One for Helen and Sal, and two for Elimination Chamber for six weeks' time. So let me know. Toilet Bay setting up. This, um. I don't know what the hell that was. Nice hot. That's supposed to be a hot tag, yeah? It didn't look like one. Scott Dawson is now the legal man. Nice kick to the small of the back. That move does hurt. For people that say wrestling isn't real, you've got to be very disgusted with yourself. Toto with a running knee to the revival bozo. Nice leg drop from Scott Dawson. Nice leg kick from Toilet Bay. Only a knock four, a two count. Nice, Tyler Driver 97. One, two. Tyler Bate was born in 1997. So he's recently had his birthday, which is, I think it was in March. <coughs> nice elbow from Scott Dawson. Nice chop block on Tyler Bates leg. Go for the pin. One, two, only not for a two count. Yeah, sounds good to me. I don't mind. Nice. Go with Guerrero style backbreaker. Dash Wilder gets a punch in the mush. Nice tandem offense. Nice. Finds carry into a sit out slam. I don't know what this can. Hi, how are you doing? Nice step up in Sakiri from Dash World onto Trent Seven. Nice elbow from Trent Seven. Go, go, go for the test of strength, which is run by Death Wilder. Um, Japanese 
Ronald played Kenta Kobashi and Mitsuhara Mazawa. Who is your favourite wrestler? Ian Irving, Click Fan. There's so many wrestlers, but they they were my favourite. Nice glowing blow from Dash Wilder onto Trent Seven. Nice high angle drop kick. Nice no, European uppercut. I'm glad they're taking a year off. Because this game is so bloody broken. I might go back to 2K19. My phone carry into the backbreaker. Goes for the pin. One, two, only enough for a two count. But it was in Mustache Mountain's corner. They, they must know better. Trent Seven gets out of whatever it was. Nice body splash, but doesn't go for the pin. If it was me, I would have capitalised. Nice ice whip to the outside bump. Trent Seven, Wolverhampton is near Birmingham, which is in the Midlands. Nice clapping blow from Dash Wilder. Both have been released. I mean the revival, not Mustache Mountain, because Mustache Mountain are a great hand to have. Nice beautiful with a kick. Scott Dawson. Nice. Hot tag from Mustache Mountain. This game is glitchy up nobody's business. The chat has gone dead. Nice power bomb from Scott Dawson. But showboats to the crowd too much. That might bite him in the arse. You never let your opponent. Nice chops to the bread basket, which is r roughly near the mid section. They look very lethargic. Nice knee strike from Scott Dawson on to Tyler Bates. Nice Indian Deathlock, which is a reverse figure four leg lock. And unfortunately, into the tag team tournament, Scott Dawson and Dash Wilder, the Rope Bible. That match was rather janky. Next ma match is a one-on-one -on -one encounter. Johnny Wrestling, Gun Prince, Sami Zayn. I will be back in two minutes. I just need to leave. Please talk amongst yourself.
Hailing from Cleveland, Ohio, with his manager and wife, Candice LeRae, Johnny Wrestling, Johnny Gargano. from Montreal, Quebec, Canada. The happy go lucky, Sammy Zane. Sammy Dane has officially got plastered. Is there anyone else's internet player now? No good. Nice fast neck sweep. Nice high angle drop kick from Johnny Wrestling. <coughs> nice snake eye from Sammy Zane. I think it's of Syrian descent. I could be wrong. The former El Generico. Nice throw and elbow from Johnny Wrestling. 
nice release northern lights soup belts. Johnny Wilson got to look in one. Only enough for a one count. Nice step up into Geary from Johnny Wrestling. Johnny Weston goes for a pin, only enough for a one count. Nice fisherman buster. Semi game with the roller. Only enough for a two count. Sammy then goes for the leg area for Messi. <coughs> no, Avalanche, Falcon Arrow from Johnny Corona, Johnny Wrestling. He supports a rubbish American football team called the Cleveland Browns. Only the decent team in Cleveland is the Cleveland Cavaliers, the basketball team. Nice springboard leg drop from Johnny Wrestling. Johnny Wrestling goes for the pin. Two, only enough for a two count. Sammy then's getting rather flustered. Nice paid up from Johnny Wrestling. Nice, high angle, belly to back, cubex. The avalanche version killed Mitch Hora Mazel. <coughs> I did watch some progress in Noah the other day. Johnny Gogano gets in at nine and a half. Nice, insecurity from Johnny Wrestling going for the Gargano Escape, which is a modified crossface. Ole, 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 ole. Sammy Zayn with the kick and closed fist. Nice high angle Saito suplex. Invented by Masaru. Saito, formal wrestler and referee. Nice release, Northern Light like Suplex. The semi then hits a Yakuza kick and a blue under the one. Only enough for a one count. It may be over after this. Nice, T-Bone Suplex to the Town Buckle. Hmm. Goes for the pin, one. Only enough for a one count, unfortunately.
Nice Irish whip. Nice long dog from Johnny Gargano. Go for him. One. Two. Only enough for a two count. Johnny Wrestling's getting rather flustered. Nice. The Kagano escape. Johnny Kagano picks up the W. Who would like DIY to reform on this game as? Dark DIY. Now on to the main event of the evening. A no hold for main event for a rematch. The world we met series is <coughs> Kevin Owens going up against John Moxley. John Moxley's representative is Shamara Joe. I would amend the event to be a slowish match. Hailing from Maryville, Quebec, Canada. The former Kevin Steen. Kevin Owen. <clears throat> I think tomorrow's a really cool on commentary, so he should do that if he does have to wind down. Hayden Farm, Huntington Beach, California, the Samoan Submission Machine, Samoa Joe. And all I've got to say is, Joe's going to kill you. He was great in TNA, Impact Wrestling, but he got a bit lazy near the end of his run. This is a no disqualification match. So anything goes. Not as high angle sunset flip power bomb. <coughs> high angle backdrop. Nice headbutt from Samoa Joe. His matches with Kenta Kabashi and Mitchell and Mazzao were really good matches. So if you do have any time to check them out, please check them out. 
The Kentakawashi match in question is a Ring of Honor match. Samoa Joe Gunsman, Kentakawashi and the pro wrestling Nora match was Mitch Horamatawa going against Samoa Joe. I've got to think what year it was. 2007, maybe. <coughs> Kevin Owens will to pay on Hilo. Kevin Owens, deck in some more job. We have been live for over an hour now. Nice. DDT followed by the back centrum by Kevin Owens. <coughs> Him and Sami Zayn will be a tag team, but not yet. I came up with, a, with the ring design. The yellow turnbuckle pads and the blue rope with the blue ring post was w, early WCW colours and the apron and canvas is CCW colours, black and yellow. Samoa with the high angle belly to back suplex. Nice sweep kick from Samoa Joe. Samoa Joe was in the 1984 Olympic Games in Los Angeles. Uh, for judo, I believe. Nice ice whip from Samoa Joe. Kevin Owens gets his feet up and nice. Larry to the back of Samoa Joe's head. I don't really know what motivates Samoa Joe. <coughs> because he really let himself go near the end of his impact run, but he does look a lot smaller. I'm going to guess that he's 235 or 230. One, two, only enough for a two count. From the Quebec Canada native. Nice belly to belly suplex. Go to flip in. One. <coughs> nice high angle power bomb. Fire first one will be tomorrow. At some point. No, it's real naked joke from tomorrow joke. Tomorrow joke picks up one point. Yo, one of fire submission. John Moxley lays out both Samoa Joe and Kevin Owens. In this universe mode, the WWE has gone out of business. The Hammers Wrestling Alliance. What? What an ending. Thank you all for watching, you've been a great audience, and I will see you again 
next week at a later time of two o'clock. I want you to do three things for me. Look after yourself and each other and don't be stupid and don't be dickheads. And I bid you a farewell for now. I have been your host, Hammond Reviews and Blue Boy 1985. And I'll be back soon with more streaming goodness.